how's it going, everybody? My name is Mike Winicki, and I'm here with Octopus Music School to teach you a little bit about jazz drumming. For a lot of drummers, jazz can be something that's intimidating or something that seems very complicated to play. So I'm here to tell you that it doesn't have to be so difficult. The jazz beat only consists of three hits on the ride cymbal, and we're gonna count it like this. One, two, a one, two, a one, two, a one, two. And on number two, we're also gonna press with the foot on the hi-hat, so it'll sound like this all together. It's very important to master this step before we get any more complicated, so let's practice it one more time. Once you feel like you've mastered that, we can start to add a little extra spice with the left hand on the snare drum. And we are going to add a snare drum note after count one. So it's gonna be happening in between the notes on the ride cymbal. And it's gonna sound something like this. So when you add that snare drum note, it shouldn't change your ride cymbal pattern at all. We still wanna make sure it sounds like one, two, a one. This is just a little extra. So once you can do it many times in a row, then you wanna alternate between not doing the note at all and adding it in to make it sound improvised like this. And you can put it at different tempos, make it sound a little bit faster, so it'll be like this. And one more thing you can do with this idea is you can place the left hand notes on various drums and it'll sound like this. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's lesson and that this made jazz drumming seem a little bit more approachable. Happy practicing.